Thank you, Alyssa. So first, I'd like to uh, congratulate the RAA on its 40-year anniversary. It's a big milestone and a very important achievement. Uh, we're very proud to be a part of the organization, so congratulations to the RAA. Uh, today I'll be covering uh, basically uh, Embraer's uh, view of the, the North American market, um, along with uh, some talk about our best-selling airplane, the E-175, and then a, a brief uh, slide on the forecast for the next 20 years. Um, in a nutshell, the, uh, the North American market is still looking pretty good. Lots of opportunities, for both new and pre-owned spanning the entire width of our product line. Uh, clearly, the 175 is our biggest seller. Uh, short term, we think uh, there's still about 130 opportunities under scope uh, where we can sell 175s. It doesn't mean we'll win them all, but uh, at least the opportunity is there. And uh, in the long term, we think it's a much bigger number due to the retirement of uh, older 70-seaters, more 50-seaters, some migration from turboprops to, uh, to jet operators. Um, so uh, again, in summary, we think that the market is, is still pretty strong. Um, we do have our challenges. Uh, of course, uh, pilots is an issue. Uh, scope clauses could help us if uh, they loosen up a bit. Um, and lastly, uh, margins, right? Everybody needs to, to have sustainable margins and they're constantly under pressure. So, um, like I said, in, uh, in, in our view, uh, the North American market is very solid right now and we expect it to continue in the short term and the long term. So there's a, our spaghetti chart, which many of you are familiar with, uh, showing the relationship between regionals and mainline. Uh, there are five networks that we have up there. We fly in four of the five. The fifth one we'll be flying in starting in July will be uh, SkyWest for Alaska. Uh, currently, our largest customer is uh, SkyWest in terms of total number of aircraft, in terms of e-jets only. It's a republic, and it has been for a long time. So uh, there are roughly 11 control groups. And by control group, I mean for SkyWest Inc., it's ExpressJet and SkyWest uh, Airlines underneath that. Of those 11, uh, the four biggest, uh, sorry, of the five biggest, four fly our airplane, and six out of the 11 fly our airplanes. Those are the control groups with the dots representing uh, Embraer customers. Embraer presence in North America, uh, turboprops, we're down to six, doesn't include cargo or charter. Uh, the number dropped quite a bit from the last time you may have seen this chart because uh, SkyWest has uh, taken the Brasilia out of service as of Tuesday last week. A sad day for us, but they'll find a new home somewhere else. Uh, ERJ family 436, EJets 420 and counting, 83 will be delivered into the market this year. So that number will go up substantially. Total of 862 right now. Longest market, roughly 2,000 miles. Shortest, 69 miles, both with the 190. JetBlue on the shortest, Air Canada on the longest route. Uh, customer base in North America, all the big names, or almost all. Um, Air Canada, American, JetBlue, Sky Regional, Compass, Shuttle, you know, Republic, Mesa, SkyWest, pretty much everybody's represented there. The big seller for us, the 175, almost every airplane we sold, uh, barring a, a, an order from SkyWest. Uh, for the E2 and trans states also for the E2. Uh, all the rest were 175 uh, with enhancements. Some people call it the plus. Uh, 350 orders, 410 options. Um, the question seems to be, you know, how, how can we get, 
how can we have such success uh, and, and gain 80% of the market in the last two and a half years? Uh, and what we're hearing people say out there is that, oh, you have the lowest price. I can guarantee you it's not price. Acquisition price, we're more expensive. We have a better airplane, we should be more expensive. We put a lot more money into the program. So what is it? What's the uh, secret sauce? Basically, it's a competitive price, a best-in-class airplane, best-in-class operating economics, best-in-class interior, best-in-class customer support, <laughs> proven uh, investment or continuous investment in the program. Uh, I think we've shown everyone that we're constantly looking for ways to improve the platform. Strong customer uh, relationships. And uh, lastly, uh, I think our customers understand that we're an excellent long-term business partner. Reliable, consistent, flexible, solid, somebody that you want to be in business with for a long time. So together, that's very compelling. But again, it's not just the price. Those are the recent orders that took us up to the 350, starting from 2013. American was 60, uh, Republic 102, SkyWest 147 in total, United 30 and 11 still undisclosed. There's the chart, 80%. Really, that's the only chart we need because at the end of the day, uh, the airlines vote with their checkbooks, right? And there's the proof. Lastly, as we look to the future, uh, what does the market look like? Uh, the journalists here today will be the first to see this. It will come out in a couple hours for the rest of the world. But uh, we're looking at 2,000 airplanes in the next 20 years. 60% of that will be in the 80 or 70 to 80 seat market. So uh, again, we think the future is very bright. Thank you.